This is impossible to fit into one minute, so here's my quick crash course on how, in the next 30 years or less, if you would really like to apply yourself, we could together build a financial vehicle that will provide you a mixture of income and savings worth about six figures a year. Who would not be excited about that? You all know where I'm going with this. Rent is red because it's the devil. On a 35 year time horizon, rent is going to continually increase. Now, that doesn't necessarily mean it's going to get more expensive for you because your wages are going to go up alongside that. But it's basically a net wash. There is no positive to where this is going. Now, what if there was a way to, I don't know, stop time? Maybe you're paying something today that you'd like to pay for the next 30 years, and then it magically disappears. It's the ideal living situation. I'm not gonna tell you that it's cheaper to buy a house today than rent, that's not the case. It's temporarily the case though, because three or four years down the road, there's a point where the rent trajectory is going to surpass what you're paying in your mortgage. It's going to then be cheaper to be living in the home that you bought. So we'll call rent today 1850. 35 years down the line, you can expect somewhere north of 8,000 a month average. 8,000 a month sounds ridiculous, but you're probably going to be making two or three times more money. Now, your mortgage today, maybe 2450. It'll get a little more expensive over time. We have taxes and insurance that increase with the value of your property, which is not even included in this anywhere. There is money and equity building and the back end other than all this. And then you get to a point where you don't have to pay that loan anymore. You've paid off your debts to the bank. Now you just owe Uncle Sam and insurance, maybe $500 a month. So if you're doing the average of $8,000 a month versus $500 a month, and sure, $7,500 a month isn't going to be quite as impactful as it is today, but that's better than zero. And when I'm getting to an older age in my life, I would much more be positioned with this figure offsetting from a mortgage. So what's the plan? You do a little bit of, of delayed gratification. You go through the process of buying a home. And this is just one property, people. It's very possible for us to do. Reach out for more information. I have a two hour C, not CE class, a two hour uh, webinar coming up on this with Brady over at Cross Country. If you'd like to sit in, leave me some info. I will shoot you some details and we'll see you there.